Ayan. So, good morning. Good morning. Um, can you hear me? Can anyone confirm? If uh, he or she can confirm me? Uh, hear me? Yes, yes, sir. When I can hear you. Thank you. Turn loud and clear. Go ahead. Yeah, thank you very much. Uh, good morning to each and every one of you. Um, ayan. Sige po. Uh, of course, this is a recorded proceeding. So, um, I hope that you are okay with it. Ayan. Recorded na po siya. And uh, before we proceed, I'd like to greet the admin uh, who are joining us this morning, uh, the deans of the different colleges, particularly the CBMA, CEIS, and CHCM. And of course, um, if there are some coming from other colleges, po, uh, good morning to each and every one of you. For the students and guests who are listening to us, good morning to each and every one of you. Ako uh, po si Alejandro Vinalay from the Registrar's Office and together with my partner po uh, in this orientation, Mr. Dennis Abilera, and the University Registrar is with us today. Hi, Doc Pong. Good morning. <laughs> okay, so check attendance muna tayo. Ayan. Ano? Okay na to? Uh -uh. Yeah. Uh, sorry, sorry. Thank you. Thank you, Kyle. Okay. So check muna tayo na attendance. No? Uh, of course, we are expecting... Um, Various batches from different colleges, po, no? but today uh, we are having the CBMA, CEIS, and CHTM. No? Uh, and of course, in, in total, po, um, sa 2022 candidates for graduation, we have 325. And as of the moment, I can see that the number of participants that we have in this Zoom is 307. Good numbers na po yan, no? 307 against 327. Konting konti na lang. No? Now, um, Sige nga po, makita ko nga po ang inyong mga ano. Uh, let me hear from the uh, CBMA. Pakasulat nga po doon ang inyong degree plus anong batch po kayo. Like for example, REM 2020. Pwede po ba? May I hear from you? Ayan, BSREM 2020. SRDM 2022. Bapa. Wow. Thank you very much for joining us this morning. BSA 2019. Uy, 2019. Ayun. Baka 2020 yan. No? Summer, mid-year. Ayan, Finma, Bapa. Ayan. Ayan, thank you very much. Ayan, sa mga BS, BSBA, ayan, CBMA. Teka muna sa tourism. Punta ako dyan. <laughs> mga excited. So I'm still in the ano po, CBMA. Uh, as of the moment, we have 204 candidates for graduation for the 2022 only. No? Uh, for the ano po, we are still waiting for the official number. Uh, Doon sa mga nagbayad. No? But uh, as of the moment, we are 204. And thank you very much for your responses. I can see BAPA, um, ano po ito? REM, HRDM, Accountancy. Ayan po. And good morning to each and every one of you. And Dr. Rosas, if you're here, good morning. Ayan. Proceed naman po tayo sa CEIS. May I see the CEIS? Pasulat nga po dyan. Sa CEIS, ayan. IT 2022. IT 2022. Um, ayan, CPE 2020. Ayan. So we are... Uh, well, ano po, no? well represented. CAIS 2021. Ayan, may CPE. Thank you very much for your responses, at least. No? We are expecting po kasi that um, aside from responding to my concerns or to my inquiries, no? uh, I hope that you're going to listen very well. Ayan. And yan, maganda na yung number natin, 327 na. Uy, sakto ah. Uh, but anyway, kasama po po kasi kami dyan. <laughs> Oy, may kase tayo. Okay, mamaya po. Ayan. And moving forward, punta naman po ako sa CHTM. Yan, pasulat nga po yung degree nyo. And yan, dami nila. Wow, thank you. SRM 2020, TM 2022. So well represented po ang mga batches po. No? And of course, by degree. Yan, go, go, go. CHTM. <laughs> yan, thank you. Yan. Sige po. And of course, uh, good morning to um, Dr. Fernando Trinidad. And of course, ang dean po kanina ng CEI, uh, CEIS, Dr. Bunag po. Ayan. We are really very glad that you are joining us this morning. Ayan, of course. And uh, those are the expected um, participants that we have this morning. Tama po, CBMA, CEIS, and CSTM. However po, of course, we do understand that those um, of you that were, not, were supposed to be joining us yesterday, hindi na kayo naka-attend, so you are joining us this morning. Can I see uh, kung saan other colleges pa, aside from CBMA, CIS, CHTM, ang nandito? Anyone? Pasulat po sa, ano, sa, sa chat box. Yung hindi, ano po, hindi CBMA, ayan, ah, ah, wala yata. Ayan, may kase. 
MHM, grad school. Ayan. Good to know po na may grad school po tayo dito because I'm going to explain some part. Ayan, medtech. Ayan po. Tama po. Kasama po yan supposedly kahapon. But yeah, of course. We welcome everyone here in this orientation. Ayan. Sige po. Thank you very much for your responses. So, um, napakilala ko na po sarili ko. No? Ako po si ano, Alejandro Vinalay. And ayan. Sige po. Uh, so, of course, today uh, is the graduation orientation. This is the second day that we're doing this. And yesterday, we have various uh, concerns po. Well, for one is because uh, yung mga iba siguro na late dumating, that's why they kept on asking questions that were previously ano na, presented na. But I do hope that with the number that we have, uh, good number na po ito, so that medyo malino po no, as we progress. Now, uh, for your questions... We are going to um, we are going to um, deal with them at a later time, no? Because if I'm going to present, ako, you have some questions, but please hold on to your horses, muna. Excited na kayo magtanong, but malay nyo, baka as we progress in the discussion, we will be able to answer that. Okay? So please um, take note of your responses first, and uh, you can actually put your ano po, baka make you an A po di portion. You can put there your questions at a later time, na lang. Okay? Para hindi tayo ano, matagalan. So, hashtag road to PICC po tayo. Excited na po ba ang lahat? May IC? Yes or no? Excited na po ba? Yes? Yes, of course. Yes, yes. Woo! Yes, of course. For the longest time, no? Um, Nag-ano talaga tayo ng two years that we did not have uh, a, a physical graduation. Kaya lang, no? I do not know if uh, this is going to affect na, us no? um, later, which is going to, ano, no? we are going to discuss at a later time. And lahat po, no? majority, I think, wala naman po hindi excited of this event. Okay? Now, of course, excited as you are, kagaya rin po namin, we would like to set some, ano, some um, rules and regulations for us to follow so that, of course, uh, our proceeding, our exercises is going to be smooth and seamless, okay? And of course, we expect everyone's uh, participation and cooperation on this, okay? Sige po. Yeah, let's proceed. Yeah, I'd like to show you a sample of the graduation program that we had during the 57th. No 57th po natin, 2019 po yan. Yeah, 2019 po yan, okay? Before the pandemic. And of course, ito po, um, ito is ticket po, sample ticket po ito, no? Kung makikita nyo, magkaiba po yan. But supposedly, I'm going to put here the 57th commencement exercises ticket. But uh, unfortunately, wala na ako mahanap. So this is the ticket that I used. But 53rd po yan. Now, essentially, this is what you are going to receive as your proof uh, when you get in, uh, when you want to get in PICC. Now, kukunin nyo po ito sa Dean's Office. Okay? So you, this is the graduation program. And inside it is, aside from the program itself, is the ticket, okay? Inserted, sa, naka, uh, i rip off niyo po yan, okay? So you're going to rip that off and present it to the guard on duty at PICC on the day of the event, okay? Now, reminder to all, you are only given two tickets only. Two tickets lang, ha? Huh? Ayan. One for the candidate for graduation and one for a companion. Okay? Dalawa lamang po, ha? Ayan. Well, no more, no less. Why? Because, of course, we are still in a pandemic. Uh, we are still, uh, our mobility is, is still somehow restricted to the full capacity. So, talagang ano, and um, look at the numbers of uh, infections that we have recently. Tumataas po siya. So, we want to prevent further uh, parang uh, uh, infection of the virus and of course tayo rin we can proceed with the graduation exercises with no hassle okay with no hiccups in that sense okay so dalawa lang ha dalawa lamang po no more no less okay next i'd like to present to you the guidelines for graduation okay and please listen very well and take it into your heart ha huh? uh, put it in your heart okay Number one, assembly time starts at 6 o'clock a.m. Saturday, June 25, 2022 at the second floor bridgeway of the Philippine International Convention Center. So this is the, the second floor bridgeway. Malaki po ito. Okay? It can accommodate uh, around 1,000 plus people. Okay? Dito. Ayan. Okay? 1,000 or more yata po yan. But uh, this is 
a big place. Okay? Yan. Now, the PICC is going to open its doors okay, at 4.30 in the morning. So we understand that some of your relatives, some of your companions are going to come from far away. So, um, and of course, basically you do not want to miss this event. This is somehow a uh, once in a lifetime event. So might as well, okay, go and attend this one without any hiccups, okay? Walang problema. And wag sana kayong malit, okay? We are going to open the doors at 4.30 a.m. and you're going to proceed inside. Ayan. And uh, please wait there hanggang sa tawagin na po kayo for the 6 o'clock a.m. Now, later on, when you are going to um, assemble assemble here, mga Avengers to na assemble, you are going to, um, some, may mga marshals po tayo that are going to uh, to assist you in uh, your, your line. Okay, uh, It's going to be uh, by degree and by school year. 2020, 2021, and 2022, okay? So for those marshals who are joining us this morning, this is how we do it, huh, Apo? Thank you very much, Po. And please be reminded that we are going to put up a, uh, um, tawag dito, um, a standee which says, meron po tayong right wing there, right wing, and left wing, and under it, are the colleges po. And yun po yung susundan nyo. And our marshals are going to, um, to, 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 um, uh, to ay ayusin yung line nyo, okay? To fix your line, yan. Next po. The processional will start promptly at 7 o'clock a.m. One of the reasons why we open the gates, uh, open the doors at 4.30 is of course we want you to get in as early as 4.30 and for you to be prepared at 6 o'clock a.m. so that at around 6.45, you're going to get in, okay, and prepare for the processional na, okay? So, we hope, okay, sabi ko nga po, we cannot reiterate this enough. 7 o'clock a.m. is the official start of our program. If you come in late, I'm going to tell you later and kung ano magiging ano niyan. Ayan. Candidates and guests who will arrive after the start of the processional will have to wait in the lobby. They may enter the plenary hall after the processional is over. Yeah. So remember, especially for the candidates for graduation, if your group, like for example, you are in a particular college, po, no? and they have already gone down sa, 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 sa first floor, you cannot join them anymore. Okay? Punta na po kay sa likod. You have to wait in the lobby and wait for you to get to, to be allowed entry. Okay? So please, sabi ko nga po, please do not be late. We want this event to be as parang seamless as possible. That's why we're doing this. And uh, just to remind you, no, during the early years, during the uh, wala pang pre-pandemic po, pre-pandemic po, no, we used to have two days graduation rehearsals, no. Uh, but now, of course, with the um, with the mobility restrictions po, we cannot do that. So that's why we're doing this for your uh, for 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 you to follow. Okay. Next. Now, the prescribed attire. Dress code, yeah. female is the Sunday best and formal shoes. Male, long sleeve shirt with tie, dark pants, and formal shoes with socks. How do you look? Pagka ito yung mga susuotin, di ba? We are looking at formal um, professionals po, no? So I'm going to explain, okay? I'm going to explain what are the, ano po, uh, the, the, um, what are the uh, dress code and the prescribed attire. Teka. Yeah, Dayan. Ayan, okay na ba yan? Is it moving now? Is my presentation moving? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Dayan, is it moving on your end? Yes, thank you. Yeah, so this is now the proper outfit for female students. So please be mindful of this. Yeah. Ano tayo? Stick to this one po tayo. Ha? Stick to this proper outfit. If you want other outfits other than this one, Ibaunin yun na lang and give it to your relatives and you can uh, you can use it at a later time. But for this event, please follow the proper outfit. Okay? Ayan. Ayan po. Look at the outfits that we're going to present to you. Not necessarily etong color ha, or not uh, necessarily the same design. No? But we are looking at uh, how long it is, how, how, uh, how um, tawag dito, uh, decent it is, how... Ano, an an pang doon, how professional you look are, di po ba? Ayan. Next po, ayan. 
Okay? This kind of pictures are this kind of dress po. Okay? Next po, yan. Okay po. Ladies, are you are, are you um, okay with this one? Are you looking at this? Yan. Okay. Yes, thank you, Majuri. Yan. Thank you. Okay, did you get it? Yan po. Maybe you, you get the idea already, no? Yan. No, no skimpy clothing? No, di po ba? Of course, you know it. We're going to be professional someday. So, might as well uh, mag-practice mag -practice na kayo magsuot ng inyong mga, ano, ng mga professional um, outfits. Okay? Yan. Now, here are the improper outfits for female. So, please take note of this. We are not going to let you in if you are going to wear these outfits. Okay? Yan. Ayan. So, so please, uh, if you have the intention of wearing this during the graduation program, our marshals are not going to let you in. Okay? Ayan. You can probably wear this after the event. Magbihis na kayo. You, you can dress up, but please do not wear this. Um, I cannot sabi ko, I cannot reiterate this enough, but please do not wear this during the event. Okay? Ayan. Those who of you who are planning na magkaroon ng, uh, ano, ng swimming after, ayan, baunin nyo na lang, but do not wear it during the uh, commencement. Okay? Clear, ladies? Ayan. So, your questions later, pa kindly put it in the Q&A. Isulat nyo po doon. Ayan. And uh, some of our, ano, of, uh, are going to help us respond to your questions. Ayan. Now, we are going to um, discuss now the improper shoes for female. And please take note. Okay po. Yan. So, open toe and nakikita yung magilid-gilid. Yan. Ayan po. Ayan. Okay? Uh, these are not allowed. You can see already the X mark there. So, if your intention is to wear one of these, please, do not try. Okay? Huwag nyo nang subukan. Parang tinagalog lang eh, no? <laughs> Ayan po. Okay? Yan. Not allowed po yung mga yan. Uh, I do not know the terms of this shoes po, but I, I think Alam nyo na po yan, mga ladies. Ayan. So, yan, ha? Please be mindful of these shoes. And, of course, the marshals, please be mindful that uh, if there are ladies that are going to wear these um, shoes, uh, that's their concern already. We are not going to let them in. Okay? Ayan. Ayan po, ha? Please take note of this. Ulit-ulit po yan, ha? So, now these are the proper shoes for female. You can choose from this. List po, no? Yan, mga options po natin. Yan, okay? Close to. And uh, even if it's a high heel, formal shoes pa rin po siya and black, okay? It can be brown, yes po. But brown in a sense na brown, very brown siya, okay? Yan. Very brown siya. And of course, uh, as you can see, um, we know that some of you are really very fond of uh, wearing high, very high heeled shoes, no? But let me remind you, if... Um, you are going to wear that one. It is at your own risk. Po, no? If you can see, uh, we have shown to you a video a while ago. Uh, kung nakikita niyo yung pababa kayo, di ba? You are going to come from the second floor of the PICC. Okay? Second floor po yun. And it's, uh, the, the carpet there is somehow thick. No? So kung minsan papasok yung dulo ng inyong, ano, ng, uh, inyong high heel and I don't know, baka maano kayo, matapilok kayo. Okay? So we do not want you to experience na matawag kayo ng balentong sister, balentong brothers, mga ganyan, no? Kasi bumalentong kayo from top to bottom. So, of course, and by the way, you are going to, the, the, the event is going to be recorded. So, you are going to be immortalized. Yung pangyayaring yun, na-immortalize siya because it is recorded, okay? So, please do not try, okay? If you can wear this with, with grace and, of course, caring, carry. And remember, ha? Huh? You are going to wear that shoes for, for the duration of the event, of the commencement exercises. Ah. Kung kere nyo, go ahead. But if not, uh, I, we highly suggest that uh, you do not try anymore. Okay? Yan. Sige po. Thank you. Oops. Ups, 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 ups. Nasaan ako? Yan. Okay. Can you still see my presentation? Yes? So, Dennis? Yes. Okay. Thank you, Mona Lisa. Yan. Mga ganyan. Pwede rin po mag-flat shoes if that is your preference. Okay? Yan. Flat shoes is okay. But as long as it is um, black or brown, yan, and close toe, 
Okay. Clear to my ladies? May I hear from you? Yes, tama. Wear comfortable shoes. Clear po ba sa mga ladies? May I get a, a response from you? Yes, thank you, Shane. Thank you, Justin. And of course, the rest po. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much for your responses. Yan. Yes, may gumagano pa. <laughs> Nakapod, no? Yan. Thank you. Thank you for your responses. Ang galing. Very responsive ang mga aking mga, ano, mga studyante. Ah, oh, studyante daw. I have some students here who are listening to us. Yan. Yan. Sige po, I have seen CEI students. Yan. Sige po, we are now going to proceed to the proper outfit for male. Napakadali lamang po ng male. Okay? Ayan. Coat and tie is okay. Ah, may may, ano, may uh, tie kayo dyan. And of course, of course, you can go away with ano po, uh, the, the coat. Yeah. Um, Miss Rachel, please put in the, it in the uh, Q&A so that it can be answered at a, at a later time. Ayan. Pwede po na long sleeves lang if you prefer. Uh, yeah, pwede rin po mag-coat and tie, but uh, just to remind you, the place is, uh, ano po, is chilly, malamig in a sense, no? So, yon. But of course, you are going to wear your um, toga, academic gown, so somehow it will uh, reduce the, the, the cool effect of the you know, place, okay? Yeah, coldness of the place. Yan, okay? Yan, ang dali lang. So, Clear to sa mga male, no? Ayan. Proceed muna tayo sa improper outfit. Ha? Improper outfit po ito, ha? Hindi pwedeng outfit for male. Okay? Ayan. Okay? Maong po, no? And, um, ano to? Yung sleeves nyo po is rolled up. Please do not roll up your sleeves just yet. Okay? If you want to roll your sleeves, mamaya na, after the event, you only have four hours, di ba? Tsagayin nyo na ito. Okay? This is once in a lifetime. So please, makinig na lang muna and follow, okay? And of course, uh, mag-sucks naman po kayo mga guys, okay? Next po, ayan, mga ganyan pormahan, okay? Please, if we see you wearing this one, uh, we are sorry, but we are not going to allow you to get in, especially those who are going to wear sneakers. Uh, wala pong sneakers, ha? Ayan po, formal attire po tayo because this is a formal event. Okay, formal attire, ha? Sige po. Next po, improper shoes for male. You have seen yung mga improper outfits po. Ayan. We now move to the improper shoes. Mga ano muna, hindi po pwede. Ayan, okay? Yung mga yan. Okay, mga colored. Okay, uh, we only allow black or brown. Okay, black or brown. Ito masyadong ano naman, maroon yata ito. Okay, uh, but please uh, make it ano, yung brown, very yung dark brown. Okay? Okay. Proper shoes for male, napakadali lang din. Yan. For the male and the ladies, maybe um, you may want to ano no, um, look your best during the event. However po, you are going to wear your toga, your academic gown. So, it will be concealed. Matatago po yan eh. So, might as well follow this one first. And then later on, if you really want to, to show off, then you can wear that after the event. Okay? Proper shoes for male. Yan, black shoes. Black shoes po, ha? Black shoes uh, or brown shoes, okay? Yan. Okay? Yan. Male, for the gentleman here. Gentleman, clear po ba? Gentleman, clear. Pasulat nga po. Yes or no? Clear? Yes, thank you. Remes, John Andre, John Denver. Sorry, random ko na lang nababasa. Ang bilis eh. Yan, thank you. Placido, thank you. Thank you, Jobu. Ayan. Christian, Calvin, thank you. Thank you for your responses. Ayan. Calvin Cruz, thank you. Yes. I was just checking kasi baka yung iba sa inyo hindi nakikinig eh. And then later on, you're going to ask naman. Okay? So, ayan. Uh, there, there's no harm in asking, no? Especially if it has not been discussed yet. Okay? Ayan. Thank you. Oh, Sir Fred, good morning. Ayan. Mga ano ko to sa, ano, sa grad school. Next po. Another, individual picture taking will not be allowed during the ceremonies. Pictures of graduates will be taken by authorized accredited or accredited photographers. So uh, please remind your companion, yan, um, not allowed po ang picture taking near the stage, okay? Because um, your companions are going to be placed somewhere far from 
the you know, the area po that you're going to be seated. Okay? So individual picture taking will not be allowed. However, if your concern is how they can take my picture, meron po tayo accredited photographer, PICC accredited photographer po ito. Our official photographer is going to be Floro Photo. They are going to be in Trinity from June 20 to 23 at the gym entrance. Okay? If you are going to look at your calendar, this is the same date that the academic gown fitting and claiming is going to be. So parang isahang punta na lang kayo dito. Okay? You have four days okay, to, to think about this one. Yan, baka magbago pa isip nyo. And this is going to be from 8 o'clock to 5 p.m. This is optional. This picture taking is optional, okay? And for those of you who are will not be able to ask or pay them uh, on these dates, uh, they will also have a station at the second floor bridgeway where you are going to uh, gather, okay, at PICC. Now, question. This, to, to make it clear, this is not part of graduation fee, huh? This is on you, okay? Kayo po magbabayad nito. Okay, so this is optional, ha? Huh? I'd like to reiterate, optional po ito. If you want them to take your picture, then you have to pay them an amount. If you do not want, it's okay. Well and good po, okay? Now, uh, if you're going to avail their services, uh, you are going to get three 5 by 7 colored prints and 300 pesos po all in na po yon. okay? What does it contain? Receiving diploma, full body, and half body. Sample. Sample naman dyan. Yan. So, ito po ang ating full body. This is the receiving diploma and this is the half body. Okay? Yan. So for those of you who are um, willing po to, to shell out uh, an additional 300 pesos, pwede, pwede po sila. And by the way po, um, after you pay, they are going to give you a ribbon. Uh, please do not lose that one because you're going to put it uh, on the top of your toga so that uh, during the commencement exercises, they will know who they are going to take pictures. Okay? Ayan. So, wag niyong wawalain po yun. Okay? And of course, please do not lose your receipt because that is what you are going to use as a ano po, uh, claiming stub when you get your pictures. Okay? Ayan. So, hindi ito part ng ano, ha, graduation fee. This is totally different. Um, uh, ano. uh, this is not part of it. Okay? Uh, ayan. Next po. Cellular phones must be in silent mode at all times. Now, if you cannot put it in off mode, okay, just put it in silent mode. Okay, silent mode na lang po tayo. And we do know that some of you are really very fond of doing live live feed or live uh, telecast or anything live na ginagawa nyo. No? Please do not do that during the event. Okay, ayan. And of course, this is of course in in ano po no uh, in respect with respect to all those that are joining the commencement exercises. Okay, yan. Next po. Children below seven years uh, seven years old and below are not allowed to enter the plenary hall. Now, of course, in consideration of the one only no one only companion that you're going to bring, siguro naman. Uh, you will not be able, you are not, you are not going to bring your child seven years old and below, okay? But of course, in consideration of those parents that they have no one, okay, to 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 ano po, to um to take care of, siguro po ngayon pa lang, we still have a lot of days, no? We we'll have a lot of uh, uh, ano pa, leg room, no, to to adjust to this one. So might as well, as of the moment, if you have uh, a child or children below seven years old. Uh, might as well um, look for someone who can take care of them for the, the, this event po, no? Because uh, we are going to apologize now that uh, we will not be able to, um, you are not going to be able to bring them in the plenary hall, okay? Clear po yun, ha? Next po. And please refrain from taking groupies, okay? We do understand that talagang kating kati na po kayo mag-picture selfie. Now, Usually, when someone takes a selfie and his or her friend sees it, talaga namang magsisilapitan po yan. But please, we are being reminded by the PICC and the Pasay City Health Protocol as well 
the LGU in, co uh, in cooperation with them, please refrain from taking groupies, okay? Uh, of course, you know, uh, what does this mean? Um, we realize that the number of uh, infection is gradually increasing. And uh, we do not want to anticipate that during our event, it's eh, level two, tayo, which, has, which is going to have a considerable impact on our event. Okay? Yeah. Uh, that, that's going to be discussed at a later time, ni Sir Dennis. Okay? But please... Uh, be, uh, please refrain from taking groupies po, ha? Huh? Please, please lang. Because the PICC and PASICT LGU is going to join us during that event. So we do not want to be ano, tagged as non-conforming months. Uh, okay? Uh, an institution that did not conform to our procedure. Okay? Huwag po sanang ganon. Next po. We are now going to proceed to the official academic food callers. We do believe that some of you have already taken, uh, went to the studio and had your ta pictures taken. So, ito po ang mga kulay, ha? Ayan. We do hope that um, ito po, you take note of this one. Ayan. For the KASE, white, uh, CBMA, and of course, for the graduate school who were who are here joining us, and EDD Maed, light blue, MAN, BN, orange, MBA, MM, and PA, yellow, GPA, lavender, Kase White, CBMA, Yellow, BSIT, naku, magka, magka dugtong na, Yellow Gold, SP Emerald Green, Eduk Light Blue, HTM, Flaming Red, CMT, Yellow Gold, SLC, and Orange, Rad Tech, Blood Red, Pharma Violet. Naku, biglang na, naayos yung ano. But anyway, I, I think you get the idea, no? Uh, these are the colors that you are going to use when you go to the, to the uh, studio, I mean. Pag tinanong kayo, anong degree po? Ayan. What is the color of your academic hood? The academic hood is this one po. No? If you can see the ano, your background, ayan, ito po yan. But later, we are going to discuss more of that. Okay? Yeah. And of course, um, aside from the academic hood, the same color goes with your tassel. Okay? Yeah. So, of course, the, um, the, the, yung mga ano natin, yung preliminaries have already been discussed. The guidelines for graduation have been discussed with you already. Let's now proceed to PICC. Woo! PICC na tayo. Okay? Naku, ipagdasal natin that during your event, level 1 pa rin tayo. Okay? Level 1 pa rin sana. Woo! Calvin, yes. Oh, kami lang ni Calvin na go. Okay? Sige, proceed na po tayo. Calvin, yeah! Okay. Next. So this is the PICC main entrance. The graduating students and your companion is going to enter in this area. Okay? Nandito po ang main entrance po natin. Okay? The graduating students and your companion. And just like what I said a while ago, the gates are going to open. The doors are going to open at 4.30 in the morning. Okay? You'll never know, di po ba? Ako po, galing po. When I graduated, uh, I came from QC lang, but I, I arrived at PICC ng around 5 o'clock. Of course, I do not want to miss okay, this, the, the event. Okay? And I do hope that you're going to do the same. ha. Kita-kita po tayo din ng maaga. Okay? Yan. More pictures. And po, so those, to those who are not familiar yet with how it looks, makadalihin po kayo ng driver nyo somewhere else. But of course, uh, we are looking at this. Ang laki-laki po niyan. Malaking space po ito. You will not lose this one. Okay? You will not miss this. Okay? Next po, ayan. So when you get inside, hi Sir Pong, ayan. So when you get inside, uh, the um, this is how it looks like. Pag, pagpasok nyo pa lang, wow, yes, we are in a different place. Di ba? Makakagising po ito. That's already 5 o'clock in the morning and this is what you see. Di po ba? Ayan. Now, if you're going to look at this one, uh, we are going to put up a photo wall here, if I'm not mistaken, uh, courtesy of the Student Affairs Center. Ayan, magbibigay po sila sa atin ng photo wall. Okay, you can take your pictures here while waiting, di ba? 4.30 onwards, eh, di ba? But huwag kayo magmamadali because we have hanggang 6 o'clock, no? Uh, at around 6 o'clock, we are going to let you, ano, in na po dun sa, ano, sa, uh, sa second floor na bridgeway, okay? So here, you will see the... Um, photo wall, okay? Yan. So, pagpasok nyo, gusto magpa-picture, okay lang. Yan. 
And um, kindly proceed to your left side. Uh, there's going to be a waiting area there. Nakaprepare na po yung mga seats po doon. You can wait there, okay? Up until 6 o'clock kung gusto nyo. But if you want, you can already proceed at a later time uh, sa, or, or advance po sa taas po. Ha? Ayan. Kakaliwa po kayo dyan. Okay? Ayan. Hindi po tayo dito sa area na to, ha? You still have to move towards the plenary hall. Medyo lalakarin nyo pa ng konti. Malapit lang. Okay? Next. For the VIPs and the honor students. Marami po ba dito ang honor students? Let me see. Pasulat nga po, MCL, CL, or SCL. Meron po ba? SCL. Yan. Wow. Ron. <laughs> Yan. Yan. Mga humble itong mga kasamahan natin. Eh. Ron. Yan, Patricia, MCL. Wow, congratulations to you. Yan. Yung mga magna, magna. Yan, mga magna. Magna nine years, di ba? Yan, mga suma. Sumasabit kung minsan. But natapos din kung laude. Yan, MCL. Oh, wow, mga humble sila. Ayaw nila magparamdam. But anyway, for, for the honor students, yan, and your companion, dito naman po kayo sa kabila, okay? We have 700 plus candidates for graduation, at least for the 2022 candidates for graduation, no? excluding pa po yung 2020 and 2021. No? But uh, we have 700 plus. So kung titingnan natin ang number of the honor students, nasa 217 po tayo as of the moment. That's for the 2022 candidates for graduation. So at least bawas po tayo ng ano dito, ng uh, uh, mag-entrance dun sa main. Okay? So the honor students and your companion, please proceed in this area, okay? Proceed po kayo dyan because that is your entrance. Now, you may ask, no? Sabihin, ay, bakit dun sa kabila, dun sa main entrance, there is a photo wall? Yes, of course, we also prepared a photo wall for you dyan sa plenary. Yan. Dun sa lobby ng plenary, there's going to be one as well para hindi kayo magsiksikan, di po ba? And of course, we are going to close, no, not really close, but Somehow we are not going to uh, um, allow students to take pictures when the uh, commencement exercises commences. Di po ba? Yan. Commence pala. Nag-start. So lahat po, bawal na po muna mag-picture-picture. But while, we, um, while, while uh, we are waiting for the official start of the event, picture-picture kayo. Go lang. Okay? Yan. Thank you. Next mo. Clear po yan ha? Yeah, so further up pictures for the forum street. Ayan po. This is the entrance. Ito po yung entrance doon. Lalakarin lang naman po yun. Very near. Ito po, no? Uh, kung dito kayo galing sa gilid because uh, you were, ano po, um, dropped off there by your, uh, uh, your driver, dito po kayo lakarin nyo lang. Malapit lang po yan. Okay? Yes. Okay. Now, when the time ticks 6 o'clock, there's going to be someone na uh, kung, kung sakali man, no, um, when everyone is still there dun sa main entrance, hindi pa sila nakakapila or dun sa lobby ng plenary, hindi pa sila pumunta sa pila, we are going to let you know. However po, for us to facilitate things, I would like to request everyone, especially the candidates for graduation, please do not wait for 6 o'clock anymore. Ha? Pag nakita nyo, quarter to 6 na, go na kayo sa second floor. Okay? So this is to facilitate things. Wala na po tayong masyadong problemahin. Okay? So assembly time na po natin at the second floor of Bridgeway. And of course, for those who just came in, uh, who did not hear what I said a while ago, we are going to put up, okay, um, <laughs> napupunta po tayo sa, ano, sa, sa second floor, you are going to see uh, standees po doon. You can see left wing, uh, right wing, and you can see there your college po. Okay, yung pila po ninyo. Yan. Sige po, move po tayo. Move forward. Now, we are now going up the second floor. This is now the assembly phase. Of course, this is the same picture that I showed you a while ago during the ano, yung initial, po, no, initial guideline, no, your number one. So you're going to get in here. Yeah, second floor na po yun, which can accommodate 1,000 plus people. Okay? And just like what I said a while ago, you can see here in this area, it may be on the left or on the right, the floor of photo. Should you decide na bigla nyo nang isip, ay, naku, walang magpipicture pala sa akin. Or, for those of you that were not able to come during the schedule, no, June 20 to 23, ayan, uh, ayun, 
Punta na po kayo dito. Okay? Dito po kayo pumunta. They're going to be very visible there. Okay? For the candidates for graduation, punta na kayo sa second floor assembly place bridge way. Okay? Now, of course, sa honor students naman po, no? Honor students, you do not have to go out. Okay? We are also going to put up a standee here which states na honor students, left, right, and re right, uh, left, right daw. Left wing and right wing with the following tags. No? May, uh, ang mga honor students po ng CAHS, CMT, SLCN. Ito po, para clear. Ayan. CAHS, CMT, SLCN. You are going to be on the left wing. Okay, sa left po kayo ha. And right po ang SCASE, CBMA, CEIS, CHTM. Pero parang nakita ko dito, kakaunti lang yung nag-respond. Eh. So I think baka hindi naman mapuno masyado. No? May we only have two MCL here and one CL. Wow. Ayan. May hahabol pa po ba? <laughs> Ayan, mga gusto ko. Ayan. Okay? So, honor students ha, please be reminded of this one. Papipilahin po kayo ng inyong marshal. Okay? To the marshals who are here, uh, please take note. And of course, um, maglalagay na po tayo ng standee po dito. Okay? With the following designations. Okay? Clear? Next po. We now proceed. At around 6.45 in the morning, targets po natin to ha. Our goal is at 6.45 in the, the morning, we are going to ask you mag-proceed na po kay sa N3. Okay? Entrance of the second floor plenary hall. Ayan. Okay? Doon pa rin, nakapila pa rin po kayo. Okay? How does it look? Ito po, no? If you are going to look uh, from afar, no? Uh, ito po, birds are, you know, somehow, no? Uh, from the top, second floor. This is how it's going to look like. Yan, lapit ko ng konti. This is the stage. And some of you are going to come from, from here. This is the left wing, okay? Context lamang pinapakita natin. But as uh, uh, candidates for honors na mga adults na po kayo, I do believe that somehow you are putting it in your parang image screen na po yan. Ano? Ayan, dito po kayo bababa. And as you can see, somehow it's really very dimly lit. Okay? Madilim po siya ng kaunti. So uh, just like what I said a while ago, if you are going to wear your high heel, talagang yung 4 inches or 5 inches, or if there are 7, bahala po. <laughs> Baka maano kayo dyan, no? ma, -ma Mabalentong kayo, no? So this is how you're going to, uh, where you're going to be seated. Ayan. Okay? Now this place po sa taas, this is the, uh, pagpuno na yung dito sa baba because we are going to let your family members sit here on this area. Ayan. Dito po. Once this area is filled, your companion or relatives or anyone who went with you will be seated here uh, on the second floor. And please be reminded, we do not have reserved seats, okay? So it's a first come, first served basis, okay? Clear po yun, ha? Next po, ayan. Prior to the exercises, ito ba? Prior to, to the exercises, nasa labas kayo, okay? You are doing the assembly, okay? Please be reminded, academic hood is placed on the left arm. Ito po, no? Ayan, nasa left arm siya, Okay? Left arm. You do not wear it yet. Academic hood po yan ha. Yung nilalagay nyo dito. Please do not wear it yet, but please put it on the left arm. Okay? And your tassel should be on the left side. Left side din po siya ha. Left side. And please do not forget to wear your face mask. Okay? So, parang pinakita ko kanina during the um, presentation, you are going to walk. Yan. Ganyan po ha. Yan. Social distancing pa rin tayo, but not too far. Okay? Yan. Para hindi tayo magtagal. Okay? Clear? Yan. Move forward na po tayo. This is how you're going to look like before the event. Wearing your academic gown. Okay? And of course, following the proper outfit that we presented a while ago. Next po. Now, right wing, left wing. Okay? Left wing, right wing. May mga ano tayo, no? may mga tayo that have difficulty identifying which one is the left, which one is the right. But somehow, you are going to see this uh, in the graduation program, which will be included in your, ano, sa pinakadulong part. Okay? So, imagine, ha, this is the second floor. 
the parents, if, for example, there are no seats available up, uh, on the, the first floor, your parents can sit here on top, on the second floor. Okay? So, just like what I said kanina, at around 6.45. Ayan na, pasok na kayo dyan. Okay? Pasok. Okay, 6.45. Ayan. At 6.45, we're going to let you in. Ayan. Oh, by the way, um, baka magtanong kayo, in this area, there are uh, comfort rooms pa rin po, no? Ayan. Should you uh, feel the urge, okay, uh, to go to the comfort room? Uh, there's a comfort room here in this area. Ayan. Okay po. Ayan, ito pala, women's toilet yata. Ayan. Ayan. Men's toilet. Ayan. Okay? Now, you're going to stay here for quite some time kasi 6.45 po yan because we... Uh, we are aiming for 7 o'clock that we are going to start. Now, at around 7 o'clock, and our MC, of course, I think you're very familiar with him. That's Sir Caleb. Sabihin niya, good morning, everyone. Welcome to the 60th commencement exercises of Trinity University of Asia. And you're going to hear yung Ida March. Di po ba? Yan. So, bababa na po kayo. Yan. Dere, derecho na kayo sa bumaba, di ba? Can you now feel it? Bababa na kayo dyan. And just a reminder, just like what I said, you are going to be a spot on. Naka, na, nasa, nasa inyo yung spotlight and there's someone taking your taking a video of you going down the stairs. Okay? So, ayan. Dere, derecho na po tayo doon. So, where are you going? Pababa kayo? Of course, at the ground floor. So, uh, more images. Ayan, pababa po kayo dyan. Yan. And basically, uh, this was taken years ago pa. So, uh, previously, we visited, we did an ocular at the PICC and they, they changed the color to green. Wow, parang finisya na rin, no? And um, magiging green na po ang uh, kulay niyan. Yan, ang pagpumunta kayo. Okay? So, malaki po yan. It can accommodate all of us. Okay? Yan. So, bababa po kayo dyan, ha? There's a handrail here. There's a handrail as well on the other side. For those of you who are feeling sick or yung, ano, yung, yung um, fear of heights, you can just hold on to the side. Ayan. And of course, heavily carpeted po yan, ha? Ayan. Next po. So this is now the ground floor. Left wing and right wing ulit tayo, ha? Ayan. Seating arrangement. This is going to be the seating arrangement that we're going to follow, okay? So the first one who's going down, dito muna siya, diretso na dyan. And then, pagpuno na, then here, 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 here. Okay, there's going to be a marshal who's going to be with you. Okay, who's going to assist you and who, on where you are going to be seated. Okay, now as you can see here, yung red lines po na ito, this is the stanchion, no? Pangharang po yan. Harang po yan so that no parents or no relative, no companion is going to be joining the graduates. Now, for example, just like what I said a while ago, if you came in late, very late for that matter, you are going to join your parents here, okay? You're not going to join your co-graduates, okay? Yeah. So when the time, when the receiving of diploma comes, you have to go downstairs and then receive your diploma and go back to where you were seated previously, okay? Now, if you're going to look at this one, on the left, on the right side, on the right wing, no? right wing po yan, the owner's parents, are going to be seated here and the grad school parents are going to be seated here. Now, please be reminded, okay? We have 217 honor students as of sa 2020 lang, ha? And um, this is, ano, sobra pa po, uh, kulang tong 150 na to. But you can sit here in this area. Overflow po yan. Now, as just like what we have said, First come, first serve po yan. Please do not get angry, particularly sa, sa mga parents. No? Uh, please tell your parents to do not ang get angry at our assers and assurettes if this area is already filled. Okay? Mag-adjust na lang po sila. Okay? And it's um, para sa inyo naman po yung, ano, yung event po na ito. No? Ayan. Now, the reason why we put your parents here, especially for the owners and parents, is that during the time that you receive, particularly sa grad school, your diploma, they have to go up with you sa stage. Okay? In the same manner that the awardees, their companion is going to go up on the stage with you. 
Okay? Now, another reminder for the honors, for the awardees, please do not forget to give the name of your companion to the dean, to the dean of your unit. Because po yun. he is going to, he or she is going to read your name plus the name of your companion, be it your relative, be it your family member, be it your father. Basta yun po, babanggitin po niya yun. So, please do not forget the to give the name of your relative to your unit head. Okay? Clear po ba yun? Yan. Sige po. Next po. The conferment of degrees. Di po ba? O, o, nakita niyo na, ongoing na po tayo, no? So, there's going to be this time, well, in... Uh, your respective deans are going to uh, call you up at um, sabihin mga deans uh, we have this number of candidates for graduation please rise, ganon so tatayo naman po kayo lahat, okay and later on when you have all, ano, risen parang ano um, si Jesus Christ na nag-rise now, sabihin ni President ni, ni Registrar pala muna sabihin ni Registrar I have the honor to present to you the 771 graduates of blah, 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 yon, 2020, yan. And the two of president is going to say, by the power vested in me, and blah, 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 yon, ang dulo po nun appertaining there too. Okay? And sasabihin po niya, you may now wear your academic hood. Yan. So what are you going to do? Siyempre, isusuot niyo na po yon. After which, you may now transfer your tassel from left to right. Teka, asan ba yung left ko? Ayan, left to right. Pag anon. So left to right. Okay, see. Let's see this example. Okay, ayan. Sabihin, you may now wear your academic hood. Tanggal muna ang sombrero. Okay, remove your cap. Then wear your... But bilisan nyo ha, bilisan. Ayan. Oh, are you familiar with this too? Ayan. Sino, kung sino makakahula niyan? May regalo sa kanila. Ayan. Ayan. So you may now wear your academic hood. And you may now transfer your tassel from left to right. <laughs> Kunwari pa si Aliana. If you can see, there's no tassel used by Aliana. No? But anyway, this happens po. No? Nawawala po minsan. Nahuhulog yung tassel as you, as, you, ano, as you move forward or you go somewhere else. Nahuhulog po. So please always keep in check. Okay? Na nandyan yung tassel nyo. Okay? Now, if there are graduate schools here, please do not follow this yet, okay? Except for graduate school students, you are not going to wear your hood yet. You are not going to transfer your tassel from left to right. Bakit? You are going to do that later po, okay? So, wag muna ha. Pag may nakita po akong graduate school dyan, na ano, ayan. <laughs> Hindi siya umaten ng orientation. Uh, Sir Fred, please inform your classmates or your batchmates, okay? Thank you. Okay na po yan ha, conferment of degrees. O sabi ni Aliana, ay nawala yung akin. Okay, so let's now proceed to the receiving of diploma. After conferring the degrees, upo muna kayo, you take a seat, and we are now going to ask you to receive your diploma. So unang-una muna, graduate school po yan. If they come here, Ikot po yan. But anyway, uh, from the receiving of the, the diploma, the context of this one is ikot po kayo. Ha? Ayan. If you come here, ikot po kayo dyan. After receiving your diploma, ikot kayo dito. Okay, follow, follow, follow po and go back to your proper seat. Okay? Di po yon. In the same manner that those who are coming from the left wing are going to do the same. Ayan, sa kabila sila. Ayan, dito galing. Yan, okay? But anyway, in galing yun dito eh. So, dito na lang po yun. Adjust na lang Latin later. Okay? Ikot kayo down and then yan. That's why for the awardees, please take note, you're going to come from here. Am I correct? Dito kayo. Lakad from here. Then, tell your family member or your relative, halika na. Okay? And then, both of you are going together here. And for the graduate school as well, ayan, sabihin nyo na, halika na. So we are going to uh, you are going to receive the diploma, okay? And your award. Next po. Clear? 
So, just to remind everyone for the receiving of, of diploma and awards, magkaiba po yun, two students at a time for the graduate school. I'm going to show you some examples at a later time. Ayan. Tigdalawa po kayo. Pag nireceive nyo for the graduate school, when you receive your diploma, tigdalawa po kayong aakit ha. For the undergraduates, three students at a time po. Okay? And when you receive your honors, for the honor honor students, tig tatlo. Okay? Tig tatlo. And medals will be handed out to students before they go up the stage. Clear po ba ito? Now, the sweet sequence of your line is going to be like this. 2020, 2021, and 22. Last na pong tatawagin ang 2022. Okay? Like for example, sa psych, lahat muna ng 2020. Sila muna alphabetically arranged and by batch. Followed by 2021, then 2022. Okay? So, ito po ang pa-follow po natin. Okay? So, there's going to be a list that's going to be followed. Please coordinate your marshal or cooperate with your marshal on the day of the event. Kasi, really, ano po ito? Uh, this is going to be very challenging, especially that we are not going to have a rehearsal. Okay? Wala na tayong rehearsal eh. So, this is ano lang, contextual na lamang po ito. Okay? Next po. This is what I was telling everyone a while ago. This is for the graduate school. So for the graduate students here who are joining us, please take note of this one. Ayan. So, luluhod po kayo. Luluhor, ha? Luluhor. Ayan. So, ayan. Handshake. Ayan. Remove your cap. So it's going to be easier for, for your um, hood to be placed. Ayan. 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 Now, uh, in this case po, no, as you can see, the student or the graduating student does not wear the face mask. Pwede nyo pong tanggalin and even po the companion can remove the face mask. Okay? Um, just for the purposes of taking pictures. Okay? We want this to be very, ano, um, be, be very, um, tawag dito, important to you. Okay? Yan. So, ganun po, ha? So it can be uh, your companion or the board of trustees or the dean who's going to, to, to transfer the tassel. But in this case po, nag-sample lamang po na tayo. Okay? Yan. Clear po ba yun, graduate students? Okay. Kikita nyo siguro kung sino ba ito. No? Yan. Punta naman tayo sa, 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 ano, sa undergraduate students. Three students at a time po. Ha? Three students. And of course, this is also a reminder to the marshals and the, to, the, to the readers, yung mga magbabasa po ng candidates for graduation, three students at a time po, ha? Ang tawag. Now, if you see that the student uh, on the list is not around, especially for the 2022 candidates for graduation, tawagin nyo pa rin, but please be mindful na tuloy nyo na po yung tawag dun sa next, ha? Ayan. Now, for the 2020 and 2021, you do not have to call on the names of everyone. Yung mga nandyan lamang po, ha? Yan. Okay, so this now is for the undergraduate students, ha? Yan. Tatig tatlo, ha? After you receive your diploma, yan, handshake. Yan, harap. And of course, just as I reminded a while ago, for picture-taking purposes, you can temporarily remove your face masks, okay? Yan, face mask pala, isa lang. Padoble-doble <laughs> isuot nyo, okay? Next po, proceed po tayo. Now, for the honor students, just like what I said a while ago, you are going up the stage holding your, uh, ano already, medals already. Yan. Andiyan na sa baba. Who's going to give it to you? Of course, the registrar's office. The staff of the registrar's of, registrar's office is going to hand to you your medals, okay? Now, Please be reminded, ha? please check what you are going to hold. Summa cum laude, that's gold. Ha? Gold. Gold po yun, ha? Uh, magna cum laude, that's silver. Okay, please check what you're going to receive on that day. And for the cum laude, that's bronze. Ha? Bronze po yun. Okay, so if the registrar staff um, mistakenly gave you a different color, I correct me na right there and then so that you, we are not going to have any concern. Okay? So for the honor students here, sabihin nyo na kaagad. But please do not get a different color, ha? <laughs> yung, yung para sa inyo talaga. So akit po kayo, hawak-hawak nyo na po yan. Please bear with the, the ano, ha? Kami-kami lang po yan. Just for us to have 
something to show you. Okay, yan. Physical distancing pa rin. Okay, face mask. Yan. Okay. Clear po yun? Yan, move forward tayo. Yan. Uh, pag na-receive na, honor students. Okay. Yan. Handshake to whoever is going to be there. It can be the board of trustees, your dean, okay, my department heads. Yan. As long as they are with you on that day. And then picture tayo. So you are given 5 to 10 seconds to work on this or to do this. So um, para seamless yung ano natin, ang movement po natin. Ha? Yan. So just like what I said, you can remove your face mask in this particular um, event po, no? And this ano lang situation so that you can take a picture remembrance din po ito no okay yan thank you now uh, for the PICC alert level 1 guidelines i'm going to proceed and give the floor to sir dennis abilera who's go, uh, who's uh, ano po, going to discuss this with you okay sir dennis i'm going to go back get back later to uh, to ano po, to discuss more content sir dennis Thank you, Sir Wen. Uh, good morning, everyone. I am tasked to discuss the Alert Level 1 guidelines. Uh, I did uh, see some comments in the chat box with regards to the possibility that we would be uh, elevated to an Alert Level 2. We are still hoping that we maintain the Alert Level 1 until the time that we have this activity in the PICC. But in the event that uh, uh, the government declares Alert Level 2, we will still continue with the uh, uh, celebration with your graduation, but uh, we will have uh, some changes with regards to the who would be uh, with you during this uh, event. Okay, um, um, next slide, sir. When okay, so as you could see, the PICC or the Philippine International Convention Center, uh, they place health and safety of their clients as a priority and uh, we also follow that same priority for everyone okay next slide sir uh, when okay so uh, indoor and outdoor venues may be utilized at 100 percent capacity that is for alert level one guys so the minimum public health standard shall be practiced so temperature scans will still be done at the entrance definitely physical distancing that's the reason why uh, sir, uh, when mentioned about uh, taking selfies and groupies, okay, uh, the face mask should be used during this time, except when you are eating or drinking, okay. And at the same time, I believe, sir, when discussed when you are about to have your pictures taken uh, in the stage by Flora Photo, again, no uh, individual uh, picture taking will be allowed. There are also available hand washing stations. Of course, we would like you to bring also your alcohol sprays or even sanitizers. Next slide, sir. Okay, so it is very important that uh, the graduate will present their original or their official vaccination card or certification. If you have digital copies of your vaccination card, you should uh, readily uh, show them to the persons that will let you in the PICC. Another thing is that we will require you to submit a photocopy or a printed copy of your vaccination cards when you get your graduation programs, which will be provided or which will be issued out on June 24, a day before the actual graduation will take place. In the event that your companion or you doesn't have any vaccination yet, uh, depending on the condition that you might have, you would need to present a negative RT-PCR that is valid for 48 hours from the date of event. So meaning your RT-PCR test should be done okay, on the 23rd of June if you are unvaccinated or your companions are unvaccinated. But we would like to ask you guys, hopefully you are vaccinated already as well as the companion that you will be bringing with you during that time. Uh, next slide, sir. So the event permits are secured by the organizers and that is TUA as well as dependent on the guidelines of the PASA ICT LGU. Next slide, sir. So no need for health declaration form. So that's a big relief. At the same time, you could use the elevators and escalators uh, for your use, especially if you have companions that would have difficulty 
uh, moving from one floor to another. Next slide, sir. Okay, so these are our contingency plans. Hopefully, like we said, uh, hopefully we still have the alert level one by that time that you will be graduating. So that would be 100% 100 capacity with the graduate and one companion. In the event that the government declares a level two or an escalation to level two, we, might, we will have to adjust accordingly. So that means 60% capacity, you would be the only one accepted in the PICC. No companion will be allowed to go, okay? So for your uh, um, peace of mind also, we have arrangement with three hospitals during the ceremony. There is also an ambulance on standby from the Pasay City LGU, and there are also isolation rooms in the PICC. Another thing is that the uh, uh, faculty from St. Tox College of Nursing as well as people from the medical dental unit are on standby in the event that uh, any of uh, your companions uh, has um, any untoward event. So we, we, we have people on standby during this time. So when next slide please. I think this is the yeah. reminders for Sir Wen. Yeah, thank, thank you, you very much, uh, sir, sir, uh, no, sir Dennis and Paul. So um, I do hope that everyone, uh, everything is clear. Um, yung kanina nga po, no? uh, if for example, the IATF is going to declare uh, a level two, then we totally have to, to, ano po, to follow the, the level two guidelines po natin. No? And of course, I think we do not need to inform everyone anymore. If for example, NCR is going to undergo level two, alam nyo na po yun, there's no companion anymore, okay? Yeah. Yeah. So uh, we are now going to proceed to the reminders. Okay. Uh, parents and guests alike are also to observe proper dress code. So we are not telling you, telling your, your relative or companion to dress the same as you are. However, po, we would like to point out that uh, for them uh, to, to wear decent attires. Po, no? uh, we do not want to see mga nakasando, nakaslippers. Okay. This is an important event. This is a formal event. So please, uh, if they're not going to wear the same as you are, at least a decent attire, okay? And a formal attire or a formal attire in that sense. Okay, clear po yun. Now, do not forget to bring your entrance tickets, okay? And as the saying goes, no ticket, no entry. We are going to say sorry, but we cannot let you enter the PICC if in cases you are going to forget your tickets at home, okay? We, sabi ko nga, we cannot reiterate this enough, no? Please put it in your to-do list. Do not forget to bring your entrance tickets, huh? Especially if your parent or companion lives far away from you and you have already given him or her the ticket, please tell him or her not to forget that ticket, okay? Baka isa ka lang akit doon. Okay, next. One companion only, okay? One companion. Ini-stress po namin to. One lamang po talaga. There's no extra, okay? Next, beware of those who sell corsads or extra tickets in front of uh, in front of ano PICC. Uh, because I remember during the early years, nung, nung graduation day ko, no, um, there are a lot of ano mga mga peddlers dun sa labas sir you, you cannot get in the PICC if you're not going to buy these corsads and do you want extra tickets nagbebenta doon please please do not believe them okay you are still going to get inside the PICC if you have with you your tickets po from Trinity and legit po yun okay uh, we do not require for you to wear corsads okay yan next po no bringing of food inside so please, if you can, please eat your breakfast, okay? Our event is going to last until 12 o'clock noon. So I, I believe that uh, if you get hungry, you get hungry. Di po ba? Yan, joke, joke lang yan. But anyway, bringing of bottled water is allowed po yan. Allowed po yan, ha? Especially during the early years, talaga, they do not allow the bringing of bottled water inside PICC. However po, with the recent changes, no, uh, the, the IATF and the health regulations, um, and of course, we anticipate that some of you are going to drink your medicine, no. Um, you are allowed to bring 
a bottled water. One liter po siguro is enough. Huwag naman masyadong malaki, okay? And of course, Via Mare will be open din naman. So, uh, for those of you who are going to feel na nagugutom na kayo, but please uh, go go to Via Mare before the event starts, ha? Huh? Yan, wag na kayo magpaka uh, mag wag niyo nang pahirapan ng mga mga assessors and marshals po na tawagin pa kayo, okay? So for those of you who are going to would like to eat, yan, sa morning po na yon, Via Mare will be open, okay? Next po, and of course, sabi ko nga po, latecomer candidates will only be allowed entry after the processional and they will be seated at the back. Reminders po ito, although I have already stated this a while ago, reminder po ito, no? and no boys to the shouting, please. Okay, this is a formal event and uh, we do realize that some of your classmates or even you yourselves, um, suma no? or na, magna, magna nine years sa, sa, sa college, no? Not to laugh about, no, but some of you gets really excited when oh, your one of your classmates is like that, and he or she receives his diploma, his or her diploma up on stage. Di po ba? Ang saya -saya. However, po, please refrain from shouting too much. Okay, this is a formal event. Okay, and limit unnecessary movements while the program is ongoing. Kating kating ka na mag selfie, mag groovy, please. Wag muna, okay? While the program is ongoing, and you see. Uh, the administration, your, de your unit heads, and the board of trustees can see you because they are going to be seated on sa, sa stage po sila. Okay, so the movements that you make can be seen by them. Okay, and uh, they can see the color of your hood. Okay, so sabi nila ay yung studente ng ganitong college hindi sumusunod. Okay, ano mangyari? Uh, was there no orientation that happened? Maganyan. And of course, please limit the number of people going to the comfort room. Um, of course, not to be very gender biased on this, but I think ladies uh, especially, they do this, no? When a lady wants to go to the comfort room, magtatawag pa yan, halika, CR tayo doon. And yung isang buong raw, ayan, lahat na sila wala doon. Okay? So please do not do that. And of course, remain standing while waiting for the processional or recessional to finish. Ayan, kasi uh, if you can see yung kanina, uh, the, the video that, that I showed you, there are going to be times when you are going to stand still, okay? While waiting for the sa, some parts of the program to end, okay? Now, of course, another thing, please do not throw your graduation cap up after the program. So we are not in the military, okay? So as much as we would like you to be very jubilant that you have already graduated, we would like to request to you to please do not throw your graduation cap up. Okay? Clear po ba yan? And just like what I said kanina, there are going to be two photo walls that will be set up that's going to be located at the main entrance that's courtesy of the Student Affairs Center and one at the plenary lobby courtesy of Trinity. Okay? Yan. And of course, just like what Sir Dennis has said a while ago, had said a while ago, Tuas medical team will be around. So should you need for medical assistance, they are going to be with us to assist. Okay. Now, here are some important dates to remember. And I, I do know that uh, you are familiar with this, but uh, we, we would like to reiterate this um, at this moment. Okay. The schedule for the measurement and rental of academic gown. Oh, by the way, after you, measure, you, you had your measurement taken, you will be receiving it on the same day, okay? Pagkasukat pa lang, ayan, give na yan sa inyo. This is going to happen on June 20 to 23, 2022, 8 o'clock to 5 p.m. only, okay? Only. Room S28 SSC building, where is this located? Yan, malapit lamang po yun sa registrar, sa second floor of the registrar's office or beside the guidance center. How much does it cost? No? Sorry. How much does it cost for the bachelor? And bachelor, 150. Masteral, 250. For the doctoral, it's 500 pesos. And now you have to give a deposit. Mag prepare na kayo. Bring with you a deposit amount. So for the bachelor and masteral, that's 500 pesos. Okay. Doctoral, that's 1,000 pesos. Okay. Yeah. Clear po yun ha. Now, uh, when will you return the academic gowns? 
Because makikita nyo, June 20 to 23, you now have the academic gulse, eh. di po ba? You still have the 24th. Pwede nyo pang labahan po yan sa bahay and so that it will somehow smell better when you wear it on the June 25. No? And of course, you can still take pictures. Kung naniniwala kayo sa jinx po na nasuot nyo na ang inyong uh, uh, ang, uh, you have already wore your, your academic gown. I don't know if that happens but kung hindi kayo naniniwala doon, go ahead. Take pictures even when you are at home. Now, returning and refunds. Okay? You can return your academic gowns after the event. After the event. At the plenary lobby. Nandun po sila. They are going to be stationed there. So siguro mga around 11.45, they are going to set up the, ano, the, the, um, the returning ano po, process po natin. No? The elegance will be there to, uh, to receive your um, academic gowns. No? And immediately after you return the academic gown, they are going to give back to you your refund. Okay. Now, one more thing. Please do not forget to bring with you your receipts. Di po ba? Binayaran nyo yan. So please show them your receipt so that they can give you back your refund. Okay? Ayan. Yung deposit nyo. Babalik naman po yun. And if you notice, no? If you will not be able to give the toga academic gown on the same day as the day's progress, there's a deduction of 50 pesos until such time that you are not going to receive any refund anymore. Okay, so this place is for uh, June 25, nasa, ple nasa plenary hall of PICC, but the remaining days, June 27 to July 7 onwards, Puyan, you can still give the uh, the the ano the academic gown back however po with deductions na po yan okay yan so we highly recommend although we do know that you are going to be very excited to to get home to go to uh, to um to to celebrate outside to eat with your family di po ba um do not forget to return Un unless of course you'd like to bring it home first yan but please be reminded of the refunds okay next Another one, Baccalaureate Mass, June 24 at 8 o'clock a.m. Please register and join on the scheduled date. It's going, it's um, posted on the TUA website, na, uh, TUA FB page po, no? Ayan. Please join us because this is for you, no? Uh, this is a blessing po, no? You are going to be blessed on this event. Next po, FAQ, before we proceed with the questions, no? Uh, will there be a graduation rehearsal? Wala na po, no? There's none because, of course, um, with the mobility restrictions, we are still in level one. We do not want to be one of those that, um, that, that, um, uh, parang dumagdag, no, sa pag increase of cases, no. Ayan. And when to receive the graduation, the graduation program? When we say the graduation program, this is your invitation. Ayan. And uh, the, the names of the candidates for graduation is inside. Plus the invitation or the ticket is also included there. You are going to receive the graduation program at the dean's office on June 24 from 9 o'clock to 3 p.m. If you're going to notice, no, this same date po is the baccalaureate mass. So 8 to 9 is the baccalaureate mass and 9 o'clock a.m. is the issue once of the graduation program. Now, what are the requirements? Please photocopy your vaccination card of both you and your companion okay because we're going to um to to take note of this one okay yan bago nyo ma receive po yun you will be required to submit this one so photocopy nyo na po kaagad okay and uh, for the different units po na nandito please take note of this i do believe that some of the units have already made their um uh, initial po no uh, requirement po na kunin na po nila yan but somehow we realize that their companions should also have uh, a photocopy of their uh, vaccination card. Okay, next part. When to claim the graduation pictures, the one that was taken by Flora Photo at the PICC, is scheduled pa po natin yan, to be announced po muna yan, ha? But it's going to be in front of the OAR. Okay? Clear po ba? And let me reiterate, para may, may ano kayo, reference po kayo, June 20 to 23, 8 o'clock to 5, fitting and claiming of academic gown. 
Chlorophoto graduation picture payment at the gym. Okay. June 24, that's the baccalaureate mass, 8 o'clock of FB Live. And the same way, June 24, claiming of graduation program at the dean's office from 9 o'clock to 3. And June 25, 2022, our 60th commencement exercises, that's going to be at the plenary hall. Uh, you may be wondering why we are scheduling the uh, claiming of the graduation program on a separate date. We have had some experience of this na di ba maaga namin binigay yung graduation program. Other students copied it and reproduced the ticket po. That's why we had a concern sa, sa number of people that went in the PICC. Okay? So please bear with us if this is our schedule. Ayan. Okay? So that's it. Um, are we going to ano? Ayan. Questions, question and answers naman po tayo. Yes, sir. Thank you, Sir Wen. Um, yes. Let's start with the first question. Any color of clothes shoes po? Black and brown lang po ang allowed, ladies. Okay, as well as for gentlemen, black and brown leather shoes po ang tatanggapin or ia-allow po. No nude colors. May nagtanong yes. po dito, red, blue, cream, no other color aside from black or dark brown po and clothes yes. shoes. Yes po. Okay. Um, no restrictions para po sa companions. Okay, pero kung ang companion nyo po ay kasama nyo pong aakyat sa stage, sana po ay uh, presentable pa rin po kasi you would be taking pictures with them and uh, that would be like uh, Sir Wen said, immortalized na. Okay, that would be your uh, graduation day. Um, other question, sir. Uh, dress code color scheme, I believe formal colors sa females. Sir Wen? Uh, uh, Diyan po si Mamaira. Mamaira can help us with that one. Mamaira? Paulit, oh, sir, when? Uh, uh, Ma'am, yung scheme, ano, yeah. dress code. Uh, color. Color scheme sa dress code daw. Ah, wala namang color scheme sa dress code except for the boys. Uh, yung slacks, kung mas maganda kung dark siya. Kasi ano, okay. pangit yung light brown sa ano, sa toga, sa, toga. sa yes. gown, academic gown. For the girls, kahit anong color, basta susundin yung ano, yung pinakita kanina. May nakita rin ako kung gustong pants, pwede rin pants. For the, ano, for the girls, for the women. So, as long as hindi siya, ano, hindi siya skimpy, uh, formal pa rin siya. Hindi lang gown na bonggang-bongga. So, sa shoes, black lang po ba ang need? Black and brown. Black and dark brown. So, Kia. So, yun. Ma'am Ma Mayra, follow up po dun sa dress ng meron po nagtanong, off-shoulder po ba is acceptable? Hindi po. Uh, naki, pinakita kanina, uh, X po ang off-shoulder. X. Okay. Thank so, you, ma'am. Hindi ma po siya acceptable. So, corporate pants and tops for females is acceptable for those who nagtatanong yes, tungkol dyan. Um, yes, sir. Hindi ko po maintindihan with regards to yung pwede po ang trousers. I believe kung male po kayo, that would be equivalent to slacks. So dark colored slacks po ang sabi nga po ni Ma'am Myra. Okay? Um, yung parking po, I, I'm sorry, may nagtanong kung magkano ang rate. Hindi po namin masasagot kung anong rate ng parking sa PICC. Meron pong parking sa loob mismo ng PICC pero meron din pong parking sa labas across lang po ng PICC. Hindi lang po namin alam ang uh, yung rate nila. Um, Pero Sir Dennis, yes, hindi naman siya kamahalan. I don't think nalalagpas siya sa 100. Hopefully ma, parang hindi naman parang dati, hindi naman parang makati rate, no. Hindi naman siguro siya kasing mahal nang sa Makati. Yes, sir. Uh, alam ko 50 lang yata binayad namin dati. Ayun. So, uh, yes, meron Yes, ma'am. Mayroon daw, ano, can we get the graduation program by June 23? Hindi po, Sir Wen? Yeah, opo. Katulad uh, nga po ng sabi ni Sir Wen, June 24 po, yes, po siya ilalabas. 
Yes. Ayun si Miss Fernandez, sabi niya 60 pesos daw ang parking. Thank you for that. Uh, Miss Gagarin, we apologize just like what Sir Wen said, uh, may reason kung bakit uh, a day before binibigay ang graduation program with the tickets kasi meron pong mga gumawa dati na pinotocopy nila. Uh, strictly one companion lang po ang papayagan. We apologize. Apektado rin po kami dahil um, several times din kami pupunta sa school and apektado rin yung gas usage po namin. We apologize for that. Uh, ano pa po ba? Uh, yung one, more than one companion, baka po wala po kayong pagstayan sa PICC grounds. That would mean dan, nandun lang po kayo sa labas. So baka po mainip yung inyong companion. That is uh, your risk to take. Depende po sa inyo yun. Um, pwede po, papapasukin Are naman po sila. Dennis? Yes, ma'am. Uh, they're asking if um, they can get the togo on the same day that they will get their academic program, uh, graduation program. Okay, the reason we have this number of days, four days for the toga and one day for the program, kasi iniiwasan po natin na magkasama-sama kayo. Baka mamaya magka-outbreak pa bago po mag-graduation. Yung iba nagtatanong kung pwedeng iba ang kumuha, pwede nyo silang i-authorize. Pero dadali nila yung kailangan na vaccine card para makuha nyo ang graduation program. So yun. Uh, may tinanong dito, Sir Dennis, binabasa ko na. Yes, ma'am. Go ahead po. companion, husband and nine-year-old. Isa lang po ang kasama, isa lang po. You, you have to choose your husband or your nine-year-old na ano na anak. Um, pinilit po natin ituloy itong PICC because gusto namin sumaya kayo, nakamakapag-march na kayo. But this is still pandemic time. Um, let's, ano, let's just enjoy the celebration. Hindi ho pwede na marami tayo doon. Pinaglaban po natin ang PICC. So and we also invited 2020 and 2021 so that they can enjoy their graduation. So siguro po next time pwede tayong maraming kasama or after the after the the graduation you can be with your family. Ganun po talaga. Mahira po. Uh, if you only knew this is supposed to be a virtual again, but we fought for it. So, sana po naintindihan ninyo. Yung kukuha ng ano, yung kukuha ng toga ulitin natin, 20 to 23 para hiwa-hiwalay po kayo. 24, pwede kayong magpadala ng kukuha ng graduation program kung hindi nyo na kaya. But take time because this is your graduation day. So, take time po. Thank you. Mamayra, I believe meron din pong nagtanong kung pwede silang magpadala ng representative para kumuha ng toga. It's up to you po yun. Pwede Ay, po yun. Pero po isusu pwede. susukatan po kayo. Susukatan hindi po kakasya. Baka magka problema kayo. So, hindi po siya advisable. Kung magka-size sila, <laughs> there's a, some uh, possibility. But, uh, Ang problema, sir, yung ulo. Yeah, yung ulo. Kaya, yung ulo. Opo, baka mamaya mahuhulog-hulog po yun or hindi magkasya. Masikip. Yes, that's correct. Meron pong tanong dito, female trousers and sleeveless po. Okay lang po, hindi po pwede ang sleeveless. Yung trousers pwede po, pero hindi po pwede ang sleeveless. I hope you understand that, guys. Okay. Um, yes, sa floor of photo po kayo, diretso magbabayad po. Hindi po sa cashier, kaya po meron silang space sa gym. At the same time, uh, I, I think it was reminded by Sir Adam kanina yung mga gustong magpakuha sa floro photo pero hindi nakapunta sa sa school. Meron pa rin silang booth katulad ng binanggit ni Sir Binalay sa walkway, sa bridgeway. So kung gusto niyo pong kunin ang uh, kanilang uh, services during that time. Okay? Um, Miss Santos, uh, sabi niya white slacks and white suit for female. Uh, katulad po nung sinabi ni May Mayra. Uh, Mayra, comment on this white slacks. 
Male or female, sir? Male, female, ma'am. Female. Uh, pwede na pang white slacks. Kaya lang ang pangit niya sa uh, academic gown. Black and Parang white. Mas maganda kasi ano eh. Uh, one color lang. Black, para yes. I mean yung... Uh, kasi pag mayroong light, uh, medyo hindi siya maganda based on uh, experience. Uh, so deadline for submission. submission yeah. ng yearbook, uh, tawag dito, kasama yan sa clearance ninyo. So matitrace natin for 2022 ASAP. ASAP. Uh -oh. Pwede po ba ipakuha sa graduating ko student ng academic daw? Nasa province po kasi ang graduating. Nung sinabi namin kanina na yung pagsusura, kung nasa province ka, lumuwas ka na lang ng maaga. Don't need na po ba mag-submit ng graduation picture? At uh, this will be discussed differently kasi different batches, iba ang ano, ang procedure, iba ang 2020, iba ang 2021, iba ang 2022. So, uh, na, mayroon din tayong nakapost na graduation guidelines. Pakihingi po sa kolehiyo nyo, kumpleto po iyon. Yung sinasabi na vaccination card, yung graduation program, we will repeat. We cannot give it on June 20 to 23 po. June 24 siya kukunin. June 24, it was explained why. Hindi pwedeng i-duplicate ang ticket. So yun po. Ang kapalit po ng graduation program ay vaccination card ninyo at ng inyong companion. The graduation pictures will be discussed different uh, in different times and pakihintay po sa inyong ano as uh, kolehiyo ninyo. Before 6:45 AM po ba graduation day considered not late? Uh, magahabul ka kasi kung 6:45 ka tatakbo hahanapin mo kung saan ang formation. So agahan niyo po ang dating kasi mahirap po ang formation. It really takes time, di ba Sir Wen? Yeah, yes, ma'am. Yes, and uh, in consideration of um, the batches that we have, we have 2020, 2021, and 2022. So we need more time po na maayos po ang ating pila. At saka, yes, yung pong nagta-target ng 6.45, agahan nyo po yung target, 6.15 na lang para wala na kayong problem. Pero mas maganda po kung 6 o'clock nandun na kayo. Nasa targeting lang po yan. Kaya nyo po yan. Um, And, yeah, ma'am. Go ahead, ma'am. Sir Dennis, go. Uh, yung mag-code for females, again, wala pong problema. Tandaan nyo po, ipapatong nyo pa rin po yung academic gown. So, na, convenience nyo rin po yun. I think that is also a question from a male graduate. Kung mag-code and tie, okay lang po mag-code and tie kayo kasi hindi naman po makikita actually ang color ng inyong Uh, coat. So, imagine nyo na lang po pag naka-academic gown po kayo na black, tapos yung background nyo po is makikita po yung inyong color ng coat. So, imagine nyo na lang po. Uh, definitely, long sleeves and tie ang requirement po. Kung gusto nyo po magsuot ng coat, nasa sa inyo po yun. Uh, sir, when any proof yes. daw na kailangan pa i-present sa gate kapag honor student, Uh, we we have the marshals there. We can check po dun sa kabila. Uh, there, there's going to be the marshals po to, to, to check on it, sir. Okay, we have faculty marshals, guys. So you would see your uh, teachers. Uh, batch 2021, ma'am. Kailan daw po ba nilang magpa-graduation picture again? Batch 2021, hindi po. Hindi kailangan. Pero kung hindi nyo, hindi nyo gusto yung picture nyo, gusto nyo palitan, pwede pang palitan. Yun. Yung Sir, 2021 uh, ay edited na. So ready na yun for dispatch sa, ano, sa ating supplier. So kung gusto nyo magpapalit ng mas magandang picture, pwede naman. 
Paki saan po pwedeng palitan, ma'am? Kung 2021 kay Ms. Gonzales, Ms. Geraldine, pwede nyo pong ibigay sa inyo, sa inyong kolehiyo. As lang po for 2022 graduates. Ano ba yun? Nawala ang post daw mo yung picture nila. Hindi, naka-video wall po kayo during that time po. Pag nakit niya po sa stage, hindi po ipopost ang pictures. Tapos, merong nagtanong kung pwede po ba na walang tie, sir. Mas maganda po na nakatay po kayo para po mas maganda ang inyong grad, uh, picture sa graduation day itself. Yes, oo. Mas maganda. Do choice pa rin naman nila. Oo. So, we are are we going to allow, ma'am? Pwede, uh, pwede naman, sir. Kaya lang pangit talaga nga. Choice nila. Formal okay. na ang dating. Oo. Oo. Ah, yes. yung sa graduation picture nyo, ganito, sa graduation picture ng 2022, kailangan yung ipasa yan kung gusto nyo makapag, makakuha kayo ng transcript of records. So kung maaga nyo kailangan, uh, the transcript of records will be released early September. So mas maganda, isubmit nyo kaagad para cleared na kayo agad. It will be part of your clearance. Uh, Miss uh, Susa or Sousa, with regards to the graduation program, pag wala po kayong graduation program, wala po kayong tickets, hindi po kayong makakapasok ng PICC. So kailangan nyo po yung grad program na yun. Ang grad pick po sa batch 2021 ay mayroon na po. Mayroon na. Uh, Ma'am, mayroong isang concern si Rich Vito. Previously, sa graduate uh, candidates were rescinded. Uh, mayroon na raw po bang updated list? Nang ano po? Uh, updated list daw po ng graduates. Kasi sabi niya, ibang grades namin hindi pa nagre-reflect. Baka mamaya we're getting excited about this graduation. Hindi pala kami kasama. Uh, please call your college. Please call your college. Hindi Mr. Vito, coordinate with your college. Ng, hindi po tayo pwedeng maglabas ng listahan ng buong lahat ng pangalan na nandun. That is Data Privacy Act po. So kung gusto nyo pong malaman, punta po kayo, uh, tawagan nyo ang kolehiyo nyo o yung advisor ninyo kung kayo ay gagraduate o hindi. Kung gusto nyo naman po, pwede nyo kami i-email kung nandun yung pangalan nyo. But supposedly, your college should have informed you. Okay. Uh, additional uh, po. I'm sorry. Uh, sige, sir. Someone is, someone is asking for a copy of this recording, of course. Uh, we will be posting this po sa aming YouTube po. No? Um, uh, si Ma'am Aliana is listening to us right now, the T-set. So uh, she's going to post it in our uh, YouTube. Uh, ano po, and will be shared to everyone po. Thank you po. Sir, um, Angel or Angel Glemau asked yung prices ng Floro Photo. I believe uh, binanggit mo kanina, sir, yung price. Tama, 300, sir. sir. 300 po. 300 po ang price ng Floro Photo. Yung uh, picture ng batch ay batch 2022. Sasubmit po sa kolehiyo ninyo. College po, college. Sir, mayroong tinatanong dito, Sir Dennis, in the event na mawala po yung program and we do have the soft copy, is that allowed? Uh, yung ticket po, hindi pwedeng soft copy. It should be the original copy. Uh, that's, that's why we deep. are releasing the program yes, um, the day before. So, yes. wala, wala pong soft po copy ang program. Ganito. Walang ibibigay na soft copy ang program. So, ingatan niyo po yun, ma'am, sir. Uh, until what time po ang graduation? We, we, we hope to finish before 12 o'clock kasi katulad ng sabi po ni Sir Vinalay, syempre gusto niya rin po magpakuha sa stage or with your uh, relatives uh, in parts of PICC up to 12 o'clock po ang ating reservation po sa PICC. That would give you enough time to finish uh, the pictures that you would like to take. And, and okay. sir, just... Sir, yes, sir. Question? <laughs> Just like ano, mga parking may spaces. question, hindi raw makapag-leave ng 20 to 23. Paano yung sa graduation toga? Respawning nyo yun. Pwede kayong magpakuha sa iba. 
but it will be your risk kung hindi kasha sa inyo ang toga. So it's really up to you kung gusto niyo pakuha sa iba. Pero po ang pangit na hindi kasha sa inyo yung cap at alanganin yung size ng gown. Uh, kung masyadong malaki ang gown, pangit. Kung masyadong maliit, pangit din po. Kung yun po. Sir, uh, Sir Wen, with regards, yes, may yes. nagtatanong na graduate school, una daw ba silang magmamarch sa 25? Yes, yes po. Sila yung una sa pila. Sila yung una On sa the pila. left side, yes. sir, no? Yeah, On the po, left side, po. yes. Left side sila. Left wing. Okay. Uh, left for wing. academic ano raw, grad fee, for the batch 2021 and 2020, you should be... Sa Floropoto po, wala pong online or GCash. Kayo po ang magbabayad. Diretso sa Floropoto. That's 300 pesos. So, magdala po kayo ng cash. So, doon naman po sa... Uh, nawala na ako, Sir Dennis. Ano yung sasabihin ko? <laughs> yung cash, ma'am, or ano, GC. Ano, GCash. Before that, Sir Dennis, pasensya na. <laughs> ang daming nagpa-pop up eh. Oo. Oh. Uh, uh, basta lahat po ng bayarin sa Floro Photo sa kanila po, yung graduation okay. uh, fees lang po ang sa school sa cashier okay. natin. For the grad fee for 2021, thank you Pamela. For the grad fee of 2020 and 2021, okay, dapat may resibo kayo niyan. Nahawakan ko na ang ano mga resibo ninyo, nakalista na sa akin kung sino ang a-attend. So ngayon for 2022, Um, ang clearance nyo, okay. ang clearance niyo ay uh, kailangan niyo para makuha ang TOR. Pero it's not a requirement yet for you to march on April uh, on June 25, okay? But if uh, if you can pay it as soon as possible, mas maganda para cleared na kayo sa sa much, much better. Much better yon. Ulitin natin, ang 1.5 na resibo at clearance ay kailangan natin sa 2020 and 2021. Bakit po? Dalawang taon at isang taon na po kayong graduate, you're supposed to be free of your obligations from the university. Okay. Hindi para nagre-reflect yung grad fee for 2022, Diane. Yung iba kasi hindi pa submitted ang grades. Hindi namin matag pag hindi kumpleto ang grades ninyo. So yung ibang teacher late nag-submit. So ngayon pa lang nagtataging si Sir Jeremy. Okay. Ma'am, meron pong tanong dito, Sir Wen. Uh, sa hindi po honors, kasama po bang aakit ang parents? Kasi wala daw sa video kanina. Ay, hindi, Sir Wen. Sila lang po. Sila lang, Sir. So um, yung graduate lang po, ang kasama po yung parents is yung honor, honor graduates po. And uh, graduate school. And graduate school po. Yes. Yan po. Ayun, meron pa po bang ibang uh, clarifications? Again, maliwanag na po yung tungkol <coughs> sa, sa uh, kuhaan ng toga. Pag nagpunta po kayo doon, makukuha nyo na rin pag uwi ang toga. Pero you have to go back on the 24th for the release of the graduation program. Before you could get the graduation program, you need to present a photocopy of your vaccination card as well as the vaccination card of your companion going with you. Meron pa po ba? Ito sir, paano po pag isang student wala siyang kasamang companion? Pwede ko ba ibigay sa ibang student yung extra ticket? Definitely, it's your choice po. Ayan. Kung gusto niyo ipamigay yung ticket niyo, okay lamang po, no? But it's your choice po. Uh, you only have two tickets po, so you use it wisely. Um, may tanong pa dito. Kay Ms. Xavier sa grad fee ng 2020, uh, hindi yun ibabawas automatic na nasa Grad fee ang TOR and diploma. That's automatic. Hindi po selective kung ano ang babayaran ninyo. Lahat po ayon ay package po. For the 2020, 2021, kailangan po ay kung may, mayroon kasi iba na nakabayad ng grad fee, hindi na nabawas. 
hindi na na-refund. Nililista na po yun ng accounting sa kanilang clearance sa gilid. Okay. So, so when, mga mga tawagin yes, yes. yung honors or yung graduates. Yung graduates po ang mauna, no, sir, when? Yes, ma'am. Graduate school muna, ma'am. Uh, then regular um regular uh, uh, regular bachelors yes opo and then honors po tayo mapapanood po ba ng ibang relatives sa labas uh, we will have a premiere in youtube of your graduation pero you edit pa siya so latest na maipapalabas ang inyong graduation online is on july 6 yon sa so when Batch ng 2020 sa covers, cover and pages. Ang atin pong grad, graduation picture as posted was January to February. In-extend natin ng March, in-extend natin hanggang June 4. Wala na po tayong extension sa cover and pages. So wala na po. Tapos na po ang ano natin. Kailangan na po natin makuha ang pictures. Okay. Yeah, Sir Wen, oh, yeah, may sir. pinakita ka daw kanina na sleeveless dress. So, acceptable daw po ba yun? Ano sir? Hindi yun sleeveless. Extended sleeves yun sir. Oh, yan. Hindi daw po Hindi yung sleeveless. Extended so, yun. Ah, Justin? yung ano siya, tawag dito, pwede yung ganun ang mismong picture, pero decent siya. Yan, hindi pwede. Sige, sir. Ito? Yan. Extended sleeve yan, sir. Extended. Yan. O, yun po nagtatanong with regards to the sleeveless. So, ito po yung example. Extended yan po. Yun. Um, sir, may nagka-clarify with regards to the academic code ng CMT at saka CEI SBSIT na yellow gold. Yes po, as posted po kanina. Um, as any colors natin. Please take a picture of this one para parehas po, no? Uh, this came from the ano, the deans na rin po eh. So, sana ba? At the same time, alam na po ng uh, elegance ko ano po yung colors niyo actually. Pareho kasing yellow gold ang CMT sa BSIT. Yes po. Okay yan. po. With approval uh, of the deans po yan. Uh, yung sa grad fee po, tapos na po ang ating bayaran ng grad fee ng May 31. Nag-extend pa rin po tayo hanggang ng June 10. So kung hindi po kayo nakabayad ng grad fee, hindi po kayo tapos na po ang ating pagtanggap. Ngayon, sige po, I'll give you a chance within the day. Wala pong advice sa amin sa grad fee. Mayroon po kami nilabas na. May nilabas po kami. Si Miss Cecil, anong year po kayo graduate? Miss Cecil. Miss Cecilia. Miss Cecil, matagal na po kami nag-post. Sige po, 20, pwede 20 kayong... 2020 ma'am. Okay, ganito. All of you who are attending, okay, and we who did not pay the grad fee yet, I'm giving you until today, until today only. This will be the last day, sir. When, ah? Today, since ito ang ating orientation, I'm giving you until today. If you did if you did not or if you do not pay today, wala na po kasi kailangan na namin ng malinis na listahan na ibibigay. Hindi ho pwede sa Friday, hindi pwede sa Friday. Pag wala po kayo sa listahan, i-run na po namin ang pangalan sa invitation. So, yun po. Okay. Ma'am, pwede na raw po bang i-announce ang Latin honors? Palagay ko i-announce nila sa kanilang relatives. Ah, pwede po. Binigay na dapat sa kanila ng, ng kolehiyo na kung ano ang honors nila. Individual po ang pagbibigay. We, we are not going to post it. Yan. Kasi wala po kaming ano, wala po kayong waiver. 
Ma'am, hanggang Miss June 13, Chama. parang si grad fee na nakasulat. Miss Chama, yung grad fee, kailang ka anak brumadwe. Miss Dana, 2022, hindi pa required magbayad ng grad fee. Okay, you can, uh, you can, for, uulitin ko po, 2020 and 2021, dapat bayad po lahat. For 2022, okay, you can attend kahit wala pa po kayong clearance. You can attend. That is your right to attend. Okay. Oh, yung ang, mga tanong ang, ni Ms. Borromeo. Hindi po kami tumatanggap ng pera sa registrar, sa cashier po, sa cashier. Bawal po kami tumanggap. Miss Cecilia, can we pay GCash? Wala po kami GCash, ma'am. Okay? May question uh, Mr. Ka pa, uh, Lucas Gian Angelo, ang tickets po ay nasa graduation program. Yun po ang importansya ng pagkuha ng graduation program. Okay. Meron pa po okay, kayong... Uh... Kumihingi po ng listahan ng nasa graduation program. Hindi po nyo makukuha ang pangalan. Walang listahan. Miss Biasca, graduate, gagraduate po kayong tatlong mag-anak. So you can ask us. Hindi po tayo pwedeng mag-post kasi po Data Privacy Act. Ang Latin honors po ay cum laude, no other awards. Cum laude, magna cum laude, and suma cum laude po. Kung mayroon po kayong recognition sa inyong kolehiyo, dun po i-recognize sa inyong pagiging dean's list. Sir Wen, meron silang sinasight yes. na sleeveless na black and white daw na naka-sleeveless. Hindi na pinakita kanina, sir. Pagbalikan ulit natin. Hindi, hindi po yata black and white yun. Uh, simply black lang yun na aalala ko. Kung ano man po yung... Ito na po. Oh, po. May nagtatanong, sir, when kung pwede na mag-leave yung 19... Ah, ito. Oh, yeah. Na, na. Of course, for those of you that uh, have no other concerns, you may already leave. Tapos na po. Uh, however, for those that need more clarification, you may stay po. Sir Wen, ito ba? Ito yata, black and white. Oh, ma'am. Yan po ay extended sleeve. Kung makikita nyo, naka-extend ng konti. Yung pong sleeveless na sinasabi natin ay yung sleeveless na uh, alam po ng mga babae yun kung anong sleeveless yung sinasabi natin. That is an extended sleeve po. And you can wear something like this. Gusto nyo, i-screenshot nyo, pakita nyo na ito yung ano nyo. Pwede po yun. Thank you sa lahat and I hope to see Yan. you soon. Oh, oh, yes, correct, correct. Uh -huh. Yung pong iba na nakita na yung halimbawa, yung resibo ng pagbabayag nyo for the 1-5, pero dapat cleared kayo, ipadala nyo yung picture sa kolehiyo ninyo. And ibigay sa amin today. <clears throat> Ayan, okay. I guess wala na po mga ma'am and sir. So we would like to thank each and every one of you for joining us this morning. I hope that everything has been clarified already. But uh, should you have further questions po, pwede rin man pong tanungin po sa register's office and of course sa inyong mga uh, respective units. With that, maraming maraming salamat po for the deans who are present here. Maraming salamat po. Ako po si Mr. Alejandro Vinalay together with Sir Dennis uh, Abilera and Ma'am Myra Ramos, our university registrar. See you soon po, yeah, June 25. We, Thank you guys. We hope to see you sooner po. Uh, po soon po. And uh, congratulations in advance po. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.